This, this is a good. This is a good question. You know, we we've been talking about this movie since Sundance, and I think we just assumed that the spoilers would be out by now, and somehow people have been respectful, and and I think what ends up happening is when people see the movie, they're glad they didn't know anything about it when they went in, so they end up kind of holding on to the info. So, you know, our main thing that we're kind of telling people is is like, look, you know, this is. Um, it, it is a romantic comedy and it starts off that way. It's about a couple that's kind of struggling in their marriage and, and they head off for that weekend away to try and revitalize their relationship. But from there, it turns into something you haven't seen before. So, um, you know, it's going to examine all the themes that I think are interesting for couples to think about. And that way, it's a great date movie. But um, come prepared to see something you haven't seen before. Yeah, I got involved with it because uh, Mark and I had a general meeting and um, me and the writer, Justin Later, had been trying to make this other project for a while and anyway, that fell through and and then uh, Mark's like, you know, let's go, let's go play and make a, a kind of smaller, uh, cheaper movie that we can just go do ourselves and so we developed this idea together and Justin and I went off and, and kind of put it on a page and, and figured out who the characters and story were and, and, uh, and then within kind of us meeting till we shot it. it was like six months so it went really quickly and um yeah it, it was an incredible kind of first experience because we were answering to ourselves there was no like answering to you know a studio or anything like that it was like we really made this this story very organically and, and naturally and, and so it was really just about being prepared and making sure that that I had done all the pre-production work and, and then we shot it in 15 days, so it went by really quickly. And and, uh, and then we did post pretty quickly as yeah. well. So it was uh, it was this kind of crazy experience that could have gone really wrong yeah. <laughs> and been horrible and, uh, and everything seemed to align right and, and we came up with something that we're really proud of. You know, I really, I've gotten into this kind of phase of my life where uh, like I will produce and act in things with you know filmmakers that I just want to be around and that I like and I really liked Charlie when I met him and he was enthusiastic and and smart and and also seemed like a good marriage of what I do which is kind of like these this kind of intensive interpersonal relationship studies and with what Charlie could do which is has this much bigger broader visual sense also interested in that relationship stuff, really good with genre as is his you know, writing partner, Justin. And, and so it just seemed like, oh, this could be a cool marriage of uh, the old and the new kind of thing for me. Um, and, and it also had a big risk involved, which is really fun when you're making a movie that's kind of smaller and cheaper because you know, we really could have fallen on our asses on this movie. You know, it's got a lot of different tones, it takes some big swings. And so the whole time we were on set, we were like, is this gonna be good? Is this is working? Like, what's happening? And 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 it's a fun way to make a movie because you're kind of scared and and you gotta stay on your toes and so I don't know. It's just um, it's a very vital process and and some of the art that I make is you know paid for by big companies and I have to be very careful with their money and we didn't have to be careful at all with this. The way the way it works, like our relationship, which started off very much in this like mentor mentee uh, relationship, which was like, I'll come come with me and I'll show you how to make this little movie. Very quickly, sort of started to shift um, because once I set the movie up with the structure of like, here's how you make these cheap independent films, and and here's a lot of my crew and and things like that. Um, then basically it things reverse and then and then Charlie just quickly took over the movie that doesn't always happen um, but I remember there being like a specific moment on set where like Charlie brought you brought me something about like uh, my character and we talked about it and then like uh, like a couple hours later I emailed Charlie and I was like you're right the movie's yours now <laughs> my son you handed me my son <laughs> My students become a teacher, <laughs> so it's a it was good. It's a healthy process. Mm. Denied bacon. Yes. Yeah. I am. I will quickly answer. Yes, this is easy. My girlfriend is vegan and gluten free, and I'm vegan, so I am totally fine. <laughs> and it is a non, <laughs> it is a non issue. Yeah. Uh, not the case in my home. <laughs> 
uh, we are carnivores across the board, um, and you know I have two children, so really the real issue would be we go out to breakfast in the morning, and, and it's it's extra, extra, extra crispy bacon. It's three extras is, is how we order it. So it's very specific in my house how bacon must happen. Not just that it happens, but it has to happen in a very specific way. <laughs>